Stanford University. The first quake, it's a magnitude seven earthquake, very close to Port-au-Prince in Haiti. In size, something very similar to the 1989 Loma Prieta earthquake here in the Bay Area. So we have a very unprepared country for earthquakes of this size, and that's basically the reason why we saw the level of destruction and number of fatalities that we saw in that event. The second earthquake, that's an 8.8 .8 magnitude in Chile, uh, in terms of amount of energy released in the earthquake, it's 500 times larger. So it's a much, much larger earthquake. And they've experienced many of these magnitude 8 earthquakes. So, so in terms of preparedness for very large magnitude earthquakes, it, it's a very different situation. The type of restart that we will see in, in Chile will be very different. They will need to recover from relatively small number of fatalities. Uh, but relative to the size of their economy, this will represent a very large economic loss. Right now, they're, they're coming up with preliminary estimates of about 20 to 30 billion U.S. dollars. And uh, for the size of their economy, this will be uh, a relatively large hit. In the case of Haiti, if, if we put in perspective the level of poverty with the level of disasters that they've been hit in terms of natural catastrophes, plus a lot of their government officials being killed in this event, we basically need to start from scratch. And there's not a lot to, to start with in terms of economy. So, so there's definitely very large contrast of a very well prepared country for uh, this event versus one that was not prepared at all. For more, please visit us at stanford.edu.